Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, and if you're new, welcome to Redesign 16. So this is where I post about beauty, fashion, and lifestyle every single week. Before I get started on this uh, new lip sense color to me called Aussie Rose in the application, please like this video and please hit the subscribe button so let's jump right into it. Hey everyone, so I thought I'd hop on and show you an oldie but goodie lip sense. It's kind of like a pinkish shimmery um, lip sense and this lip sense will last you all day and I will show you the application and what it looks like. It's a new color, kind of new color to me. It's more of a summer lip sense so but who cares like I wear any color all year round and I thought it would look really pretty with this eyeshadow look that I have done so if you've never heard of lip sense lip sense is a liquid lip color that turns <laughs> turns <sighs> doesn't turn I'm talking shifting gears here so Lip Sense is a liquid lip color that is equal to three tubes of regular Lip Sense. It is wax free, lead free, it's vegan uh, free, cruelty free, so it's not tested on any animals, doesn't have any animals, any animal products in it. It lasts from four to 18 hours. Um, it's crease, or kiss proof and smudge proof. And you add three thin layers, and in between those three thin layers, your lips cannot touch um, because you don't want them to stick together. Once you have the lip sense on, and in between, you can fix it up. I don't know if I said that. Oh, yeah, I did say it was wax free and lead free. So... After the third layer, you have to you have to seal it in with gloss gloss. With doing the lip sense, you want to go in the same direction you started with. But when you top it with the gloss gloss, you don't have to. So you want to make sure that your lips are dry and clean. So I'm taking this rag that I have and I'm just getting it a little bit damp or what. And I'm just cleaning off my lips, okay? And you want to make sure that your lips do not touch, but you want to make sure that the lip sense is like dry before you add another layer to it, okay? So, my lips are clean and dry. That's all the food and makeup. If you are on the fence about uh, makeup, you want to shake the tube for, it doesn't matter, every time, even if it's new, you want to shake it. And that little clicking noise is actually a bead in the lip sense that is mixing up your color together. And you want to make sure that it's really shook well so here we go this is called aussie rose so i don't know i'm branching out it might be too bold for this look but i'm just going with it so you want to go in the same direction that you started with and you want to um when you open it and do every layer you want to wipe off the excess Here's layer one. I off the excess. Okay, you wanna make sure that 
just lay it on. So, let it dry, and then do layer two. Make sure it's shy to touch, and it is. So I'm going in with layer two. Same direction. Are you off the excess? This would be the perfect time to do your house or anything while it dries. Dry to the touch. Third layer. This is the last layer. There we go. I'm gonna fix it up right here. Last layer. Oh, I got some. Right there. Oh. Third layer. Dry, shreddy, past. So I'm gonna add the glossy gloss. Make sure it's dry. Yep. Try to touch. Then you want to rub your lips together. I think it's the perfect color to seal it in. Once it's sealed in, you could blot it off and change it out with a lip sense lip gloss to change the color. But I really, really like it. I'm going to clean up here and come back with the end result for you guys. So this is the end result of the Aussie Rose lip sense it is very pretty it has a shimmer to it i really really like it and i'm glad that i showed you guys on camera if you are on the fence about lip sense don't be it's way better than regular lip sense you don't have to keep reapplying it you apply it once and then you just use gloss gloss whenever you feel like it so in the last from four to 18 hours which i um can attest to that i've worn it for many many 
hours, like over 12 hours. So if you are wanting, I can help you with a starter kit. Now a starter kit is $55 and it comes with a lip scent of your choice and a glossy gloss. Now that's $55. If you want to add the oops remover to remove it, it's an extra $10. But if you want a mini size lip sense, those are cheaper. They're 19. So, and they're the size of a shadow sense. But if you need help, questions or anything, don't hesitate to ask me. I will put my link down below so that you can shop this or any lip sense you would like. Or enjoy um so yeah please like this video and please give it a thumb or please like this video and please hit the subscribe button before you leave and ring the bell so that you will be notified when I post new videos every single time first come first serve thanks for watching